Yeah, Mark, welcome back to Patriarch. This is Series 5. Series 5 is my first commissioned art. Uh, my girlfriend and I were stationed in the Middle East for a period of time, and when we left, we had to leave behind a painting that she really loved, and it was a painting of a poppy. And so we're going to recreate that as best I can, and she'll be able to pick whichever one she likes the most, and the rest will be available on PatriotGallery.com. All right, so here we go, series five. My first color is gonna be green. I'm gonna lay down a base color. Wow! Wow! <laughs> that Henry has some power. <laughs> this is the second time Henry laid down a series yeah. punch. That's really pretty there. It looks like grass uh -huh. going on that one. Got a little bit of dirt kicked up, but that will come off the canvases. We've seen before that it comes off. So uh, I like it. I, I like that can... first can. So I don't think we need a second one. We're start with our red and our orange. Right, so I told you Patriarch was dangerous. Oh, ah, just kidding. It's paint. <laughs> and here comes shot two in the Poppy series. We're going to add red. I hit that can nice and low down on the bottom. And it might have overpowered some of the green. Two on the bottom have no green on them anymore. But uh, we'll take care of that. We are getting ready to add the orange paint to the poppy paintings. Well, that one got some nice orange splots, but not, not very many. These are pretty covered in orange. That one back there has red and orange, but kind of lost its green a little bit. So, like I said on the last one, we're going to uh, add some acrylic colors now in the small tubes and uh, finish it up with that. As promised, we're going to start shooting the small tubes try and add some texture and color to these poppy paintings. The bottom did great. Oh, that did. That got a nice splatter of orange, as you can see. The tube I got a really good hit on. So, very happy with that shot placement. It got some really nice splashes of orange over on these two, and on that one, especially down at the bottom. All right, so uh, let's keep adding color. Okay, so, one of the fun things about shooting these little tubes is trying to get them lined up. But I think I'm squared up now, so uh, here goes the next color. That was a really good shot. Where'd he go? Some nice red over onto that one and some nice red onto that one. And some rice, nice red down on the bottom. But uh, I think we're gonna need a little bit more red than that. Let me check the tube and see if it has more paint in it. It does. I hit it pretty good. I think I shot it in the hole and came out the back there which I guess it doesn't get much better than that, shot-wise. So, uh, yeah, that tube's pretty much done. It, well, it has a little bit in it. I guess I can hang it this way and shoot it again. Yeah. All right, so here we 
are continuing with that red tube. All right, so uh, hit the bottom of that. It's nice and square there. It's done. And uh, that's all the paint out of that one. So we'll keep adding colors. All right, so here we go, adding to the colors. So we did get a nice splash down there on the bottom. Very orange splashes down there on that. Uh, looks like part of the tube hit that back painting. So this painting has a small hole in it. It was caused by the back end of the tube. As you can see, that's a little metal end of the tube that was folded over. And that got carried. The shot was here. But this deflected off of there and went through the painting here, which... Uh, and you found it on the back of the yeah, painting. Yeah, I found it behind the painting, So, because I was curious what made the hole. I was positive it wasn't a bullet, so yeah, it was this small piece of shrap metal. But that's Patriarch. Uh, this is one of the ones I found just now, and I was aiming here, and my bullet hit there, so again, missed the... But it, it opens them much. up. It opens them up really nicely. Oh, it opens them up wonderfully and spreads the paint out. So, uh, Patriarch. Butterflies like it too. He thinks it's a meadow already. He wants to go on those flowers. <laughs> oh, look, look. Yeah. He really does think it's puppies. More red. So I got some red down on the bottom. <laughs> right up in the upper corner of that wood. And got some red over here. And you know what, we got a little more red on the bottom there. So all in all, that wasn't a bad tube. The angle of it wasn't perfect. So there is a little bit of paint in the bottom. There's a lot on the floor, on the ground. A little bit of paint in the bottom there. So I think I'm going to hang that up and go ahead and shoot that bottom. So here's the second shot on that same red tube of paint that has the paint down in the bottom. I got a nice splash of paint down there. And as you can see, there's nothing left of the tube. Uh, got that. And nice red drops up in there. So that was uh, definitely worth getting the extra paint out of that, the bottom half of that. So really happy with that tube. All right, so we're gonna add some green to the poppies on series five. That did pretty cool. Yeah, pretty nice green coverage. We got some nice green splatters over there and some nice green up there. So uh, it got paint on the four remaining canvases. And it looks like I might be able to get a little bit more out of here. Ugh. So looks like there's probably some paint in the bottom of that yet. So we'll go ahead and shoot it. And then we'll call this series done. 
So here we are adding the rest of that green paint. One more time? Or is it empty? Yeah, I think I got one more in it. Looks empty now. Yeah, that's empty. So I got that one in the center, and now that's empty. And I think uh, series five is done. I think. I am very happy with my commission. I have lots of favorites. I only get to keep one. It's going to be really hard to pick. Excellent. Probably have to go uni mini kind of thing. <laughs> so thank you very much. This was awesome experience. So series five is in the books. So at home, thank you for your interest in Patriarch, thank you for watching the videos, but I must insist that you not try this at home. I am a professional firearms instructor with years of experience, and I'm a United States Marine. So again, do not try this at home. I mean you. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up and make sure to visit our other videos as well. To view and purchase the artwork, please visit patriarchgallery.com.